here's the general setup for the shaft. We realized why do we need to cut the shaft or clean the shaft all the way? We can just scab on another board and we'll mount the pillow bearing to that side. But we run into another problem. Let's try and turn these around. And what happens? We run into the set screws, or set bolts in this case, for the uh, retainment, retainment washer, retainment uh, bearing, whatever those are called. Um, I'm going to have to uh, get some lube in these uh, bearings. Now our, we'll have another pulley coming off of here that will uh, engage the keyway there. And then that'll run with the V-belt right about there down to the middle rim on the trommel. We're going to need to get uh, some other material. Um, we need a rust converter to uh, protect the shaft um, and uh, other things that uh, have lots of uh, damage from being inside the swamp cooler. I'm not sure what to do with this die-cast ZMAC uh, pulley to uh, help protect it uh, from additional uh, corrosion. But we will need to uh, either replace these bolts with uh, internal set screws or at least at the bare minimum cut them down so that they're short enough to uh, not run into the board on the mount. Uh, somewhere over here, I believe, is where the uh, motor will end up mounting. And then that will go from about a two, two and a half inch pulley over to this 11 inch pulley, down to the two inch pulley, and then down to the uh, trommel uh, that's about a 22 inch, uh, circumference. Uh, once we have the, uh, pulley mounted here, I'll run a string around both pulleys so that I can measure how, what distance, what length of belt that we need for this, uh, section to go from the pulley here down to there. And then I'll see whether or not we can get away with using the pulley here uh, that came with the swamp cooler and we'll go uh, if we can reuse that we will if we're shorter we'll just get another uh, belt since we're already buying one um, but that should uh, work out for there uh, have a little bit more uh, hand sawing to do right here and then figure out the uh, wiring. We are just about ready to be able to run this.